a man in a British Columbia superstore is filming an alleged shoplifter trying to leave the store with a cart full of merchandise. You gonna pay for that? Huh? You gonna pay for that? Yeah. Where? Huh? You gonna pay for it? He's dismissing the man filming, but there's someone else he's going to have to face, and she means business. Uh, the woman who claims to have seen the man shoving roast beefs into his backpack earlier rips the man's mask off. Come on, bud. While the man filming grabs the car full of goods. Come on. Get out. Thus thwarting the alleged would-be thief. Just jack up the price for everybody else because of you. The boat finally got caught. Though he does get away with his backpack. Come on. He is later identified and arrested for theft. Shake your and go. The woman who confronted the shoplifter was 73-year-old former bank teller Elaine Galloway, who was once reportedly held at gunpoint while at work. Get out! So shoplifters, if you're thinking of stealing anywhere near Elaine, Think again. Hey guys, you're not a cop. You go easy on her. Hey, I got you recording, honey. It's okay. Two loss prevention employees have apprehended a teenage girl they believe was shoplifting inside a Washington supermarket. Police are allowed to do that. They're going too rough. Yeah. Look at her Let her go. The young woman reportedly fled the store when loss prevention staff tried to detain her for concealing candy. Now, they're trying to force her back inside, sparking the ire of other customers witnessing the altercation. Are you, are you a cop? Do you have a badge? You don't have, yeah, absolutely. But the more the young woman resists being apprehended, the more physical things become. No, you are gonna get arrested. Yeah, I got it on video. No, this is way beyond what you're supposed you to do. You hurt her too. Hey, hey, let her go. What are you doing, man? Hey? She's crying again. Oh, I'm posting this all over social media. Look at all these people. Oh, my God. Customers step in to try to calm the young girl down. I got you on video, honey. It's going all over social media. But the struggle continues as the loss prevention employees eventually manage to pull the distraught teen to her feet and get her inside the store's lobby while continuing to defend their tactics to outraged customers. Hey, I got it all on. Yes, it does. You're hurting her. None of your business. Dude, I, don't even cover my face. Okay? Get out of here. Yeah. You're real. lost prevention. You're, You're lost prevention. prevention. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a customer. Don't even talk to me. Exactly. I'm sorry, we got this on video. Let's go. You guys have to keep her. Hey, just sit right there. Don't, don't, don't fight them. Don't fight them. Cops are coming. They're right on that screen. A police officer finally arrives as each party pleads their case. They literally beat her. The tense situation finally comes to an end. The 14-year-old is arrested and charged with robbery. While the store releases a statement in support of their security's actions. Hey, hey, let her go! An unfortunate state of affairs where there are no clear winners. Hey, No, I'm not gonna let go. We're gonna call the police and deal with this the right way. You know, I'll you have to see you when you assault someone, you'll go to jail. Good, good. Don't sure, okay, when the police get it, we'll see. Yeah? We'll see, okay? Yeah. Okay, yes, we will see. We'll see. This woman was allegedly caught shoplifting at this pharmacy in Hillsboro, Oregon. You're not gonna go anywhere. We're gonna call the police. Yeah, you know. The store security guard is preventing her from fleeing. You'll go to but she's now claiming she was brought back into the store against her will. You just hurt me in the parking lot. You don't shoplift here. You can go somewhere else, but not here. Fine. Let me go somewhere else. The security guard is gripping the woman's bag because he believes it contains the stolen goods. You're not going anywhere. 
anywhere. You show up, let's just stay right here, and we're gonna call the police. You're gonna get arrested. Yeah. It's real simple. Let go of my purse. But the woman seems to be willing to do whatever it takes to leave with her bag. Ma'am, oh, are you gonna start kicking? Yes. You gonna start kicking after shoplifting? Start, 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 start kicking. He put me in the parking lot. You shoplifted. As the tug of war escalates, the situation quickly spins out of control. Yeah. Oh, really? I'm gonna take you down for that. Yeah. The security guard remains determined to detain the unruly woman until police arrive. No, no, stop it. Stop. Even as other customers advise him to ease off. I'm funny, no. I told you, okay? I don't want it. I don't want it. She wants to stay. Do you know her? Do you know her? A store employee tries to divert customers away from the fray. Keep the line going. Yeah. If you have something to check out, please. Let check go of me! Please check out. Please. But this epic struggle is far from over. Stop it! Oh, start kicking. Watch what happens. Oh, really? Stop it! Stop it! Her. Stop it! No! He's still smaller than you. I'm not hitting her. I'm hitting myself. I Stop it! Don't fight him either. Stop it. You I am you're now. being filmed, ma'am. At last, right, the police. Oh, you've done your job. police arrive, and the woman finally bails on her purse. Come here. Can I have my glasses, please? Turn around. Just find your bag. Drop your keys. He actually is. <laughs> you know you that. Turn around right? on me. It's going to be bad for you. Face the other way. Don't move. Got it? Yes. Put your feet together. The 26-year-old woman is arrested without further incident and charged with third-degree robbery. Because the security officer has authority to detain a customer if there's probable cause that shoplifting occurred, he is not charged with anything. A disturbing situation that is wholly preventable by not shoplifting in the first place. Oh, really? I'm gonna take you down for that now. At a clothing boutique, a security camera records a customer browsing with the help of an employee. Everything appears normal, but while store owner Sofia Romo is away from the shop, she gets an alert about some suspicious activity. My manager said the shop was really busy. Um, if I could check the cameras, because he thought this lady was stealing. And so I checked the cameras remotely on my phone. Sofia believes she spots the woman putting items in her purse and tells her manager. He decided to follow her out the shop because I told him I was only five minutes away. I could be there in five minutes. The manager takes a photo of the woman as she leaves the store and informs Sophia as he follows the woman down the street and onto a bus. And I was like, okay, well, I'm by the next bus stop. I'm gonna hop on. And so I got on the bus and just immediately started recording. Guys, okay, so this raggedy ass bitch just came into erotic and stole from my store. Stole from my store. Okay, stop, don't touch me. And we're gonna follow her to her house because she says she's gonna pay for it there, right? Yes. Okay. So enjoy the ride. Sophia believes she has caught the woman red-handed and she isn't done making her point. Let's play a game called Look in the Thief's Purse. Let's see what she has. Stop. Oh, she also took a skirt, Justin. Did you see that? What? Yeah. Honestly, I'm fed up. This happens all the time, like multiple times a week, and we're not able to catch them like while they're doing it every time. So I had the opportunity to actually catch her. You raggedy bitch. You look at me like I'm crazy and you stole from me. The irony. It feels really personal because it is personal. Sophia contacts the police, and when the woman exits the bus, she is arrested and charged with misdemeanor theft. The only thing she said to me, like when we got off the bus before the cops got there, she was like, This is harassment. I'm like, Poor you, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, what do you, like, you can't steal from people and expect your actions not to have consequences. I don't know what kind of world she's living in, but. There were consequences that day.
The woman is released on bond, and the case is currently pending. You look at me like I'm crazy, and you stole from me. The irony. A store clerk and an alleged shoplifter are engaged in a brutal tug of war at a grocery store in Hawaii. And things are escalating quickly. The suspected shoplifter appears to be attempting to flee after the employee tussling with him allegedly spotted him putting bottles of wine in his backpack. The employee slows him down by keeping a firm grasp on his backpack full of goods, which is still on his back. And as she now drags him back into the store, the employee offers the alleged shoplifter an ultimatum. The man finally releases several bottles of wine. But the employee refuses to relent until she gets them all. She unloads the remaining spirits from the bag, and the man returns. Sorry, everybody. Though he does get his bag, he also gets a final warning from the employee. Good advice, which he is more than welcome to take with him, free of charge. Come on. 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 Come on.